Hello friends, welcome back to another video tutorial in SketchUp 2021 for beginners. I am architect Sonu Rai from Glad Studio and in this video tutorial, I am going to teach you how to insert AutoCAD file into SketchUp. So I am going to my AutoCAD file here and this is a small residence and I finalized the drawing with the client and you should make sure that all the line should be continuous line it should not be break line and doors and windows should be properly placed along with text and also the uh, metric file or fit or inches you are working you should be aware of that so now i am going to save this file to my desktop here and i'm going to click save as and i'm going to save on my desktop to any version here and now i'm going to my sketchup here So now I'm going to sketch up and this is our template file in the inches. So I'm going to import my drawing here. So I'm going to file import and we'll go to desktop and we'll select the drawing and you should make sure that AutoCAD files dot dwg dot dxf should be selected here. You click this there are a lot of other uh, format of files so you should make sure that AutoCAD files is selected and now click import and you should see the import results AutoCAD entities imported layers blocks arch circles it should live like this and close this and now you can see your drawing here and you will now explore this and after this you can create a group also if you want so I am going to uh, make a component of this and I am going to now take the measurement of this of any reference like doors or walls that is walls outer walls should be 9 inches inner walls should be 4 and a half inches and doors should be 3 feet so I am going to take the outer measurement and with the help of tape measure tool we can measure our scale here and I am going to click on this end and now this end which is 9 feet so it is uh, large in size so we have to rescale with the help of tape measure tool only so my outer wall is 9 inches so if I am going to my AutoCAD file and I am taking the measurement here it is 9 inches so we should make this also to 9 inches so I am going to click uh, at one end here with the help of tape measure tool here and next is here which is 9 feet and I will click here and now I will drag inside and now I will type 9 inches here type 9 inches enter and now it is asking do you want to resize the model so I am going to click yes and now we will see our model here and I am going to take a uh, measurement again with the tape measure tool I will click on this end and this end which is 9 inch which is perfectly fine and it is rescaled to our drawing format in AutoCAD and now we are ready to work on this and with the help of line tool here we can start tracing this suppose I am going to trace this here end and this end and this end and again we will match to this end so now it is in a uh, face here we have face is created and now we are ready to extrude this with the help of push pull we can simply drag this and you can type suppose this wall is 10 feet we will click 10 feet here enter and likewise we can start tracing the remaining parts also and I will make a detailed tutorial on this how to work into AutoCAD floor plan 3D in the coming tutorials so I am going to Put and I will type 10 inches here, 10 feet sorry enter and likewise will extrude the remaining parts and I'm going to use blind tool here and with 
the help of Stroop and I am going to type 10 feet here. So in the next tutorial I will come with detailed modeling. So 10 feet. This was the tutorial for today's session. In the next session, I will come with some more interesting topic in SketchUp. So thanks for watching. Please like, share and subscribe my channel.